I just wanted to show you this really awesome um, pork. I guess it's a marinade. What I'm going to do is uh, make it in this bag, put the pork chops in, or you can use a two pound tenderloin if you want. Stick the pork chops in. I'm going to freeze it this way and then I'm going to cook it later this week, probably on Sunday and it's Tuesday now. We'll see how it turns out. I just dump the whole thing in the crock pot, stick it on low for like eight hours or so until the pork chops are done. So here's what I have, can't speak today. Here's how you do it. You start off with one small onion chopped up. Then you take a quarter of a cup of soy sauce and put that in. I'm using low sodium. So throw that in. Then you want, got my olive oil here, two tablespoons of olive oil. Okay. One and a half tablespoons of yellow mustard. I'm going to cooperate. I'm running out. I hope I have enough. There's one. And here's a half. I need some new measuring spoons. These have all been through whoops, the garbage disposal a few times. I don't know if you can see how chewed up they are. Um, then we need three tablespoons of maple syrup. Now, I made this once before and my husband and son really liked it. So, Three tablespoons of maple syrup. And we need oh, here it is. one teaspoon of onion powder. Everything is falling over on me here. One teaspoon of onion powder and one and a half teaspoons of garlic powder. And I'm down at the bottom of this garlic powder, so I'm gonna have to fight with it. There's one and a half. And that's all there is to it. Take it out. Kind of sorry about my arm there. Squish it around, get it nice and mixed up. Throw your pork in there. Or you could actually just throw this in the crock pot. You don't have to freeze it. You just throw it in the crock pot with um, the tenderloin or the pork chops and let it go. I'm going to um, get the pork chops in here and stick it in the freezer. Here they are. They're in the bag, freezer bag with the marinade. I'm just going to pop them in the freezer. And when we're ready to cook them, which I think will be Sunday, but, you know, plans change. Um, I'm just going to pop them in the crock pot, almost in microwave, pop them in the crock pot on low for six to eight hours. Um, really just watch them. Sunday, you know, we can eat whenever it's done. So I'll just keep an eye on them and see when they're done. So give this recipe a try. Let me know what you think um, and give my video a thumbs up, please. You can find me on Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, and Facebook at Lee's Home 05. I'll leave the links to all of those down below in the description box. Thanks.